Yeah, today I'm going to show you the C14s. It's erratic. It's a badass reel. Most of everything Shimano makes is badass. Pretty good. Spin like a dream. I think uh, these were the first ones that they came out with the Thundas. A little bit larger ones. <clears throat> I think now they offer the sustains, but they're pretty pricey. I think those ones are like 300. These ones are like 200. It's pretty nice. Use them for a halibut or whatnot. You know, something with smaller test line. About six, seven, six, eight pounds. They come in different sizes. Um, they're pretty good. I got a whole bunch of them. It's not even funny. Yeah, it's just my little collection. So me and my buddies got you know stuff to use. Yes, I do have a bolt. Uh, I got a 16 foot. Uh, Uh, I forget the name, but uh, anyways, it's a pretty good boat. Well, basically, we're using these to catch pretty good sized halibuts. Um, the drags on it's pretty good. This is newer stuff Shimano's making. Let me see what is it. Propulsions there. That's been around for a while. The X Wrap 2, I think that's the shielding on it. Just like the newer uh, Trinidad's and Italicas, they put a different coat on them. This is a Trinidad A white handle. I got a few of these. Just, they're pretty light, they're pretty much hollow. Oshigi. Oh, not an easy one. But, anyways, guys. You should pick up some of these. They're about 200 bucks. They're not bad, you know. It's, it's a good product. Yeah. Uh, company paired up with uh, the new uh, Shimano rods. The one with the EVAs. I'll go get it. Controversies. What is it? Can you see it? Controversy. It's upside down, my bad. Yeah, these are good rods. They're light with the EVA cork handles. Yeah, still new. I haven't taken off the thing yet. I used them already. Just, you know, you wake up early in the morning, you get kind of lazy. Uh, Yeah, it's not season right now, but you know, it's bass. They're out there. Thanks for looking. <laughs>